Hey, what is happening, guys? Call of Duty Blackouts Kid here, coming at you with another Tech Tuesday review. Today, I have a very interesting tech product today, another webcam that boasts to be better than the, than the Renleo 1080p webcam. This is a $70 or you can actually get it for 10% off, so $60 4K, uh, 4K video webcam. We'll see how much that delivers. Get a little eye privacy glass here. And, oh, even a little tripod. Okay, we're getting somewhere. And the webcam itself. How to install it, plug and play. So let's uh, let's check it out here. The Luca 4K webcam. It boasts 8 megapixels, full 4K. It says 4K PC webcam captures full HD at a wide angle, unparalleled perspective, wide variety of conditions when you live stream or video chat. It does boast 3840 by 2160 resolution and um, four times the amount of 1080p, obviously. A dual microphone, which there is dual microphones. Pretty much, yeah, this is um, a 4K webcam, specs and all that too. So let's see how well it compares. Right now we are actually recording with the... Uh, the Logitech C920. Uh, we're gonna see how well this one compares, being that it is 4K and a newer type of webcam. It also has a pause and plus uh, pause and play thing on the top here, which is actually pretty pretty interesting. Although this is super thin, I'm actually very surprised it's this thin. Although eh, it's about the same size as the my uh, my Logitech webcam, so. Let me get this set up and we'll see the difference here in a second. Okay, it says we're setting up camera. It does come with like a nice little tripod, which is a nice little bonus. Um, not very big or tall. It's probably about four inches off the ground. Between like one without a privacy web, and it's nice just to have it so you can just shut it down like this. Well, that's kind of zoomed in. Jesus. That's default. Why is it so zoomed in? This is the 4K, and then this is the this is the Logitech. It's so zoomed. I'm gonna mess around on the uh, video configurer. I can't change zoom. 60 hertz gain. I have full con uh, control of all this stuff. I will say it looks pretty damn amazing. I will check out custom and see what the resolution can max out at. It is. Ooh, not 4K, 32, and it's only, si what the hell is going on? It's only boasting 20 FPS. Hold on, this is a little f glitchy here, hold on. I have no idea. What the hell is this doing? That is so weird. It looks nice now, but it's only 20 FPS. I can only get it to 32, 64, 24, 48. <laughs> That's so weird. Um, yeah, it seems pretty decent. Let me do 25, 92, 1944. Only 20 FPS again. And it's not full screen. It's only a little bit. Hmm. Well, this is the... This is the call. Uh, go back to the highest FPS we can, or highest um, 3264 by 2448. It doesn't look bad. FPS is a little jittery. It's only 20 FPS. Although I will say the quality is pretty damn good. I will say. Pretty damn good. I will say. Um, maybe if I change OBS to output 30, whatever this is. Uh, so I couldn't change it off for 1080p because I'm not using a higher than 1080p display, I'm assuming. But let me change this to actually 1080p so I can get that letterbox off. And when if it's at 1080p, it's only 30 FPS, so you're not gaining anything better than like the Logitech webcam. Although when you go back to 1080p, it's all the way zoomed again. That's kind of weird. I wonder why that is. I mean, if you want something kind of zoomed, like this is me just sitting naturally, though. And then this is me in the why it's like that. I'm not exactly sure. 
I can't. Like. So yeah, it, it does. It does do pretty much 4K. It just does not. Uh, it's super zoomed. But when I do 4K, like the nearest to 4K, it's not as zoomed as it was. But now it's like not full capacity. And it's like square. It's kind of weird. I'm so confused by this. I will get it to work, I promise. Some some things that I see right off the back is um, the Logitech is more like real uh a little bit more temperature wise um more true to scale i guess more realistic and then the 4k one it's actually like smoothing my face out making it look a little bit better which is kind of nice it does some favor for me and then like even like even looking in my hair it, without video compression as well uh, the, when i upload this to youtube compression is a little bit different than what you might see um in, in like what I'm recording so like even inside uh, on the right side I'm more there's like you can see like oil on my skin uh, my hair is is actually you can see some sort of individual strands even like when I do this you can kind of see that so like it's kind of it's still really really good though I will say but of course running it at um, 4k it does um, it's a little choppy 20 FPS, you can see that. The other one, my uh, Logitech is, uh, I do believe, only 1080 30 as well. But you can see kind of a difference inside the video quality and compression and all that kind of stuff. Like even even looking at this from like sitting in my in my state, like it's not bad. It looks really really good on both. Honestly, trying to stream off this, like you have like a little square. I guess you could do like a little overlay, like when you're playing a game. But overall, like the 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 Logitech is just still superior. I haven't really found anything really close to it. Yeah, um, I guess the next test would be to um, see the differences between the mics. Um, like I have this weird little overlay thing here. This is gonna be audio from this guy right here. I'm gonna do a little tap test, and that's from the um, 4K camera. It's pretty, I don't really know what they sound like, but when I go to record the video, I will um, declare the winner of the mic test uh, for that. Like, okay, so I guess one thing that I will say is when it is in 4K, the quality in the background is actually pretty damn crisp. I just wish it was full uh, exposure on both sides. It's more letterboxed more than uh, 1080p 4K. And of course, this is the dreaded C920S microphone uh, from the Logitech, the tap test. So yeah, this is, uh, yeah, Logitech isn't, their cameras are great, but their uh, quality is awful on their microphones. And personally, I couldn't care less. So this little forky camera, it's not bad, but if you really wanted to stream on OBS, uh, to get this thing to work would be a little bit more troublesome, um, and you'd have to be kind of far away for the thing to work, I think, properly, honestly. The 1080p looks pretty good, and the 4K is super crisp. It even shows, like, the lines in my shirt and stuff like that. Pretty good webcam for the $60 that I paid for it. And, um, yeah, a really pretty good micro uh, camera at 4K resolution. Um, if you obviously could... I would spend the money and get the Logitech. It's still the best webcam you could possibly get at the current market. And, um, yeah, it's pretty good. But if you're really going toward more of a budget, I would recommend this, um, 4K, Luca. Or even if you want to, check out my video on the 1080p uh, Renleo webcam, as they will do... A more of a job di directing kind of what um, the Logitech and the Merlita webcam do for each other. And whether or not you can kind of compare the two cameras. If I was going to pick this one or the Merlita, I'd probably pick this one. They're right around the same price and it has a little bit more um, resolution. Although the Merlita is a full screen 1080p and the FOV is a little bit more 
bigger than this, it kind of widens the shot even more instead of compressing it like this one would do. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe um, to the channel uh, as it really helps us out and helps us grow. Like the video as well would also show a great amount of support. And uh, also, please uh, check out more Tech Tuesday videos. We do a new tech video every single Tuesday. And um, we have great products like webcams, controllers, graphics cards, and a bunch of other crazy stuff that pop in. And uh, may save you a buck or two. We kind of go more budget-oriented. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.